Hello everyone, this is Rabia from Anderson's TV. <laughs> this is NAM 2020. We're here at the Only Ball slash Music Man stand. And we have it, uh, Robert to tell us uh, about some of the new stuff. Only Ball. We've got out Only Ball. And so uh, coming out this year uh, in April, we have the new Sabre guitar. It's an Akume body, mahogany body with a premium 3 8 inch maple top. So this binding here is actually all natural oh. right there. This one here, this finish is called the Blue Moonstone. It comes with an ebony fretboard and a roasted uh, maple neck. Uh, the custom the pickups are actually uh, Ernie Ball custom pickups with a five-way switch for tonal versatility. And as you can see, the finish is absolutely stunning. So we have the Blue Moonstone, the Cobra, which comes with black hardware. And then we have the Honeysuckle, which is right below. Swap mics, swap mics, Pete, swap mics. And so, sorry, I didn't hear what you said. So uh, all the specs on these are... Uh, the specs on, on this one are a, a 3 8 inch maple top okay, yeah. with a good Akume body, yeah. so it's a mahogany body. Yeah. So it's really like an ideal versatile player's guitar. Uh, it's got Ernie Ball custom Music Man pickups, yeah. a five way switch. Cool. Yeah. Quite thin body as well. Yeah, thin. Is uh, it, it's a different size. shape, isn't it? It's a different body shape from anything you've ever done before. Huh? Yeah, it's a different body shape for sure. We contoured, cut a little bit out of the oh, back yeah. side here, make it nice and comfortable. Yeah. But it's still, you know, it's a very solid guitar. And with that 3 8 uh, maple top, it gives it a lot of snap and clarity. What a look at her. Yeah, that looks beautiful. Here's the bougie burst here. So. Bougie. 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 <laughs> I'm hearing that word a lot recently. Yeah. Really? What does that mean? It means like, ooh, bougie, classy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bougie! Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna use that now. Hashtag, yeah. hashtag bougie. All of these, uh, all these Sabre guitars will be available April 2020 globally. Okay, and pricing on these? We know that. Uh, I don't have any prices. No pricing yet. Just check the links below for all of this stuff. That's always check the links. Yeah, I'm absolutely loving the flame maple neck on this, the roasted flame maple neck. I mean, honestly. I mean, you what guys, a music man, they do the some of the absolute. Beautiful, most beautiful uh, flame maple oh, necks do. in the industry. I mean, that is a looker, and isn't it? I mean, look at that. It is like my cutlass. I've got the cutlass with the flame maple neck. It's just stunning. You know yeah. what? The thing as well I like about this one, these, these, the new Sabre in particular is like, clearly you go like hard rock metal on this. You could go something way more chill on this. You know, like all yeah. you're really doing is changing a few subtleties and yet it looks like it's aimed at a different crowd, which yeah. I like. Yeah, cool. And now here's something that I'm, I'm, uh, I've been looking at, but I haven't seen in the flesh yet. Uh, the oh, Mariposa, yeah. yes. which is super awesome shape. And I did this, this here. Anyways, yeah, that oh, is cool. Just feel that, Rabia, feel it. Touch the little knob there. <laughs> the little knob clicks good. So tell us, tell us a story oh. about these. Uh, so the Mariposa was a collaboration we did with Omar Rodriguez Lopez from yep. uh, the Mars Volta at the drive-in. It's a mahogany body with this ornate floral pickguard, laser etched. These controls are actually individual volume pots for each individual pickup. So ah. this is your just your volume for your neck pickup, oh. your volume for your bridge pickup. Nice. It's kind of like a like a like a real workhorse kind of a, of a guitar. Yeah. But it's extremely lightweight. You can pick up this guitar here. This is the Dorado Green. Oh wow! It's freakishly light. Oh yeah. But you know we didn't sacrifice any of the tone or the any neck of profile the is good. Yeah, the neck profile is great. Ebony fretboard, yeah. white pearlescent block inlays, matching headstock. And then, so these are these are the normal mariposas, and then these are the deluxe mariposas. Nah, I like comes, this one. Yeah, with a little bit of gold. Yeah, the gold hardware, the top hat of the uh, yeah. knobs, and the uh, thicker, uh, bolder uh, laser etching. Oh man, I mean that that the pink that is just yeah, the, salmon. So the salmon. Finish, the finishes are uh, dorado green, pueblo pink, uh, imperial black, and then imperial white. Oh. Guitars around now. They've, they were released this last, just past October. Yeah. Let's see if we get some of those, and I would love to do a video on those at some point. But let, there we go. Let's see. Right. Uh, what else have we got? We were talking about some new strings coming in as well. So, you know, we are at Anderton's. We use uh, only ball strings. The slinkies. We are the slinky gang. Um, and I'm just getting into the uh, to the ten and a half. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going yeah. it on on uh, on the PRS and the and just to, just to, it gives it a little bit more sort of. Just something. What was the word? Hashtag. Bushy. Bushy. It's a bit of bushy. Uh, so what, what's new here? Uh, so new here, we have two different uh, seven total new sets that will be announced. That's these top seven over here. Okay. So we have the Mighty Slinky, which is an 8.5 to 40. Hyper, which is an 8 to 42. What? Turbo, which is a 9.5 to 46. That sits between like hybrid and regular. Yeah. Uh, Mondo, 10.5 to 52. Skinny top, beefy bottom. Wow. Beefy uh, bottom. Yeah. Magnum, which comes with a 22 Wound G. 
uh, and seven string uh, skinny top heavy bottom, which expands our famous skinny top to 62 gauge for seven string yeah. players. So these, yeah, these could also people that do slide stuff could, uh, yeah, would, exactly, like, yeah, would also use those, right? Super handy gauges actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ten and a half to 52 is a is a nice. If you're in like E flat or something, that would be absolutely such a nice feeling. It's really guitar. cool. Yeah, it's a great way to maintain your tension depending on what tuning you're gonna play. Doesn't in. doesn't people just steal all of these? Just think they're free and walk away with them. Oh, like it looks like you're trying to right now. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, coming out uh, in March is the Mighty, Turbo, oh. Mondo, and Skinny Top Beefy Bottom, and yeah. then the uh, in the summer a Hyper Slinky, Magnum Slinky, and Seven String Skinny Top. Awesome! Will out. Well, we need to get them in and sort them out. Yeah. Who comes up with the names? I think we all do. It's kind of a collaboration. Of did you come up with I one? Of any of them. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not that smart. <laughs> if you did, which one would you? Which one's your favorite name? Uh, I really like Skinny Top Beefy Bottom just because I think it's so like right on the uh, beefy with, bottom. Um, well, like the way we did Skinny Top Heavy Bottom. It's like, yeah, yeah. but no, this is the beefy bottom because we kind of drew some inspiration from our famous beefy set. Uh, like, progressive. Yeah. yeah. Hashtag like Bushy. Play on words. Yeah. Hashtag Bushy. <laughs> bushy. Right. Um, and you've got some. Uh, let's move on. The future. This is the future. Well, we, 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 you had them last year, I understand, yes. right? But now they're ready to go this year. Is yeah. that correct? Yeah, correct. They'll be available March 2020. This is the VP Ernie Ball VP Junior Tuner. Uh, it comes with a full touchscreen display. Uh, we added a couple extra features this time around. Uh, we have a Kevlar cord. Has a discrete buffer. Works for 9 volt and 18 volt. As you can see here, you can you know have a visual display for your volume, <laughs> which is great, wow. especially if you're like a, you know. A, if you're playing in your live gig and you know, hey, the verses are on seven and the you know the chorus coming, I gotta kick it up a notch. That's again. so cool. And the solo comes and you kick it to ten. Sorry, it doesn't go to eleven. <laughs> oh, it just go to eleven today. <laughs> yeah, but you can double tap and you can change modes whether you want just all tuner, all volume, or both. I like both personally. Also, when you're in tuner mode, you can double tap and you can change your, oh. your uh, reference pitch. Uh, after you double tap and change your reference pitch, so let's say let's say you don't want the touch screen going on though. What you do is you can hold it down and it'll actually lock whatever mode you're in. And now, you don't have to worry about the touchscreen because it's already, it's, it's, locked. it's locked in. So you're not gonna bump your reference pitch, you're not gonna bump anything, and the tuner's really fast and accurate. So the you question- have a foot scanner, like you have on your iPhone, when you put it up, it sort of scans I know it's you using it. Oh, you're allowed to it, turn up. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're allowed to play. Yeah. Um, uh, my question, I'm sure a lot of people that are watching this have, is the durability of said screen, because yeah. obviously, uh, a gig environment, when things get a bit ropey, a bit out of hand, you know, no. exactly. Like, what what's the sitch going on? Uh, like? The sitch is that we, the the screen is actually recessed into the pedal. So you when you're putting your foot on it, you're actually not really touching the screen at all with your foot. Right. Okay. Um, so there is a little bit of a separation between the screen and your foot. Yeah. Um, but also, uh, the uh, the pedal is actually made to function regardless. So let's say you had like you really stepped on it. I mean, anything breaks, right? I mean, yeah. it's life. Um, but it's actually the pedal set up to work regardless whether or not the uh, on the on the electronic side it's an analog pedal, so it'll still get signal through even if for some reason you decide to jump on it and break right. your screen. Okay. Yeah. Because I tend to stand on it. I literally, I'll literally stand up on it and then when I do that I'll be standing on it. Or get your tiptoe on the screen like this <laughs> and oh, yeah. try a pirouette kind or, of thing. Or drop a brick, you know, directly. Uh, yeah, yeah. Just, just because everything breaks. It's really, really cool. And, and when will they be shipping them? So the, all of these will be available in uh, four of these four different finishes in March 2020. We have the white, red, black, and silver. 2020. It's the best volume pedal ever, so I'm excited about that. Um, let's move on. So in the studio at Anderson's, when we do our videos, you've probably seen these patch cables. We use them a lot, all the time, and they're great, and they're very durable, and they come in two different lengths. But I can see here there's something cooler and probably more pedal board friendly. Yeah, definitely. These are our new flat ribbon patch cables. Yeah. This has really got a lot of pedal people really excited. It's got metal ends. They're flat and they can twist and bend in any direction you want. That's pretty and cool, so isn't it? It's really great for layouts. So, you know, I'm sure you, everyone deals with the frustration of oh. having your pedals, input jacks and output jacks, not lining up for exactly the way you and want you can, them to. That is very cool. Look at that. That's very cool. That is very absolutely cool. worth getting on here because that is so. Uh, wait, these are great, but yeah. for instance, when we are doing the videos, you see you know, size when we do like a sound like video or something, we just, it's like, and if yeah, the, the pedals move around on the yeah. table and you can't, you know. You can see the size difference just alone in, yeah. the, in the profile of the. You know, and space. the fact that this is very soft, uh, great. Yep. We're so definitely going to get some inch, of them in. 6 inch, 12 inch, and 24 inch, and a full pedal board pack. And these come out next month. So. 12 inch will do, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, 
do. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay, well, thank you very it's much, Ben. We're gonna, we're gonna, it is the third day, fourth day, but we're gonna pop over and see some of the Sterling stuff. But before, do you want to show us something really quick over here? Yeah, there's a yeah. limited majesty, it's really let's have a, Let's have a quick look at that as well. So, besides having a couple new finish options like the uh, Ember Glow, Pink Sand, I'm oh, sorry, Pink Sand, uh, Red Phoenix, and Smoke oh, Pearl, cool. we have this special Purple Nebula. There's only 200 of these gonna be made globally, worldwide. Six and seven strings are available in this model, but this is actually a, it's a giant quilt top the new Dreamcatcher and Rainmaker pickups. Wow. Like Marzio. But here's the here's the beauty of it. So you have this beautiful quilt top, right? Mm. With all their sides. And then you have it's oh. two strip <laughs> two strips of the mahogany with the center strip of flame maple. Oh man, that's just yeah. that's, so, that's, yeah. that's funny. It's, it's really a cornucopia of uh, wood selections and the pickups are rented made to enhance that uh, the wood selection, but as you can see, it's just absolutely stunning. It is stunning. There's a thing with Nebula going on this year at NAM, I think. There's a couple of Nebula things. Uh, For anyone that out isn't artists. aware, Majesty is John Petrucci's signature line. Yeah, uh, I'm sure you. I'm sure you're all sure aware. Just, just clearing that, that up in case, you know. Yeah. So, so these will be available. Uh, um, these will be available. Sorry, these sorry. will be available in May 2020, and like I said, they're limited to 200. So each one comes with a certificate of authenticity. Cool. Well, Robert, thank you very much for your, all your help. We're going to be popping over to the uh, Sterling uh, wall and have a look there. Thanks, man. Pleasure. 2020. Cheers, man. Oh, okay, oh, that. so uh, we're now here at the Sterling by Music Man, and we're here with Josh. Josh. Yes, Josh. Uh, <laughs> to just show us a little bit of the of the what's new at the Sterling uh, yeah, range absolutely. for Music Man. Uh, so something we're introducing new is our higher end uh, instruments in the Sterling by Music Man line. Starting with our John Petrucci Majesty models. Oh, nice. Which now feature ebony fretboards um, as well as stainless steel frets. Nice. Demarzio Crunch Lab and Liquifier pickups in them as well. They're available in majestic purple and royal red <laughs> for the Majesty 200X and the seven strings available in royal red. Uh, then in our new JP150 line, we are now introducing all those same features with the ebony fretboards, uh, stainless steel frets and crunch lab and liquefier pickups in a beautiful eminence purple finish with a 12 dB push-push volume boost included as well. Uh, so one of our most popular instruments from last year was our Majesty uh, 100X series featuring the shieldless design. Uh, these are going to be reintroduced, uh, are renewed for the uh, 2020 year with all the same gray colors that were so popular last year. Uh, something we do have brand new for 2020 is our new Cutlass uh, Jason Richardson signature model. Uh. It's uh, Jason's unique take on the Cutlass with the shaved horn for easier fret access, as well as a 12 dB push-push volume boost, push-push coil tap in the tone position as well, uh, with a poplar burl body or poplar burl top over an alder body. A uh, new finish in our Valentine line is our brand new vintage sunburst finish. Uh, Beautiful. As you can see, yeah, that white pickguard goes yeah. beautifully with the vintage sunburst background behind it. Um, the roasted maple neck along with the 12 dB push-push boost, some of the most popular features in this instrument. Uh, then moving on to one of our best sellers last year, our Valentine, our St. Vincent line, oh, yes. which Absolutely. is available with dual humbucker configurations in uh, Fiesta Red as well as Daphne Blue, and it's, also it's a good color that. Yeah, that it's that beautiful. color was one of the most popular ones yeah. last year. So really happy to be reintroducing it this year, uh, along with the triple mini humbucker configuration uh, available in Vincent Blue and Stealth Black. Fantastic. Yeah, uh, moving into our bases. Uh, this is so cool, isn't it? Yeah, we, we're, we're really happy to introduce our first ever short scale base. It's got a 30 inch scale with a passive volume boost, push push volume boost, as well as a three way selector knob, which allows the user to switch between series, parallel, and true single coil. Uh, and wow. it also features the first ever neodymium pickup in our line, which we worked alongside the Music Man team to develop something that not only emulates their sound, but matches it. Um, so this is one of our big instruments that we're really excited about introducing, yeah. and it's available in Daphne Blue and Olympic White. Uh, then moving on to the new Stingray Ray 34 for this year, features a black gloss finish with visible swamp ash wood grain lines. Uh, has a clear pick guard and to show off that striking finish uh, and is available uh, for $899.99 US map price. Uh, one of our really big releases last year was our dual humbucker configuration bases. Uh, we're now introducing those in a new Daphne blue finish. Features two Alnico humbucker pickups with that roasted maple neck uh, and fretboard. And this one is still available in the existing pearl white and stealth black. 
and then something we're really excited about introducing into our uh, cool. into our sub series line. Yeah, it, that this is our new Cutlass short scale. It's a 24 oh. inch scale with an HS pickup configuration. <laughs> uh, it's available in shell pink and mint green. This is actually uh, the first instrument that's exclusive to the Sterling by Music Man line. There's no Music Man counterpart to this oh. uh, for the time being. So uh, if you're interested in picking up the short scale guitar, it's going to be available through our sub series entry level lineup. Awesome and a good price as well. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That $299.99 US map price. Uh, it's going to be really popular amongst our yeah. users. Um, one of our biggest introductions last year was our Cutlass sub-series line. Uh, we're bringing that ba line back with the uh, SSS configuration right. available in charcoal frost and Daphne blue, as well as the HSS configuration available in stealth black and vintage cream at a $299.99 price point. Wow, you can't tell the difference really, you know what I mean? It's well, right. so well done. Mm -hmm. I love Absolutely. that. Absolutely, yeah, I mean, th that's something awesome. that we've worked really hard alongside uh, the Music Man team with our product development process. Yeah to come up with stuff that uh, you know meets that quality standard yeah. set by the Ernie Ball Music Man yeah. team. Amazing. Uh, yeah, and uh, again, with the popularity of our HH basses last year, we're really happy to introduce those into our sub-series line, featuring dual uh, ceramic humbuckers uh, for this year, as well as all the great features from our best-selling uh, Ray 4 and Ray 5 Stingray line. Yeah. They're both available in olive green and lake blue metallic, uh, and are going to map for $379.99 for the wow. 4-string and $399 for the 5. Uh, and then lastly, we have our brand new left-handed vintage Sunburst satin bases after many requests from <laughs> our users for yeah. a, a new finish in our uh, left-handed line. We're really happy to introduce the vintage Sunburst satin and also introduce our very first ever five-string lefty wow. into the lineup. Uh, they're right. going to go for $329.99 for the four-string and $379.99 for the five. Well, that's a lot of stuff there to take in, ladies and gentlemen. But if you want uh, more info on it, I'm sure you can go in the links below. And uh, thank you very much, man. Absolutely. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Awesome. See you in the Cheers, next video. Man. Thank you very much. Peace. You guys have a good one. Thank you.